Gosh, the lag is kind of getting a bit much, to be honest. Like, it's hard for me to control some of these armies. It's fine when you're not at war. Yeah. Why'd you build so many forts, Lambert? Oh, you. <laughs> <laughs> Delete them. I need them. You don't. You don't understand. They're my everything. <laughs> it's all you've got going for you. Wish pig, can you tell us why we haven't seen the goblins yet? There's a there's a, a tide of, of thing green things that should have appeared and they haven't. I wanna know why. Sixteen sixty four, maybe it's just not early enough. Or late enough rather? Uh no, that won't be it. They murdered my face and I didn't get this far in. It's possible you both skipped the event that causes it. Due to what? Digging too fast, perhaps? Right. If you dig too deeply and too greedily, you get a Balrog. But if you dig too deeply, with capital two uh, and too greedily, uh, then then you're apparently fine. Yeah. The AI does seem like they do a pretty good job of using the battle wizard stuff. Like, I would even say that they have better micro than I do right now. But, you know, I'm at 75% of my force limit, and I could just print a few more stacks, get them, get them drilled up, go kick their ass. Yeah. There. 120,000 more dwarves shall rise. This is why I want to have a whole bunch of, like, subject dwarves on the borders. I think I'm going to make... I want to make client states really soon. I would also help out with admin points. But I don't want to give up the actual holds, because I like them. They are but fun. then again, if I don't give up the holds, then my derps won't be very strong. Hmm. How greedy am I? I mean, like, do you really want the answer to that question? I guess. Very. How is he going right through my fort? Excuse me? Uh-oh. Lambert, there aren't enough forts in my country. There are. Oh. No, -uh, they're you're marching make through my stuff. You're asking me if I'm if I want to start again. What is going to make us need to start again is this. Is too many forts and the game gets too sluggish. That like that's gonna be the death. You can deal with just a little bit less army tradition. I believe in you. Nuh uh. Yaha. -huh. I need it. You don't. Rebuild the Dwarvar Rail. Wait, can Dwarvar Rail get destroyed? Oh, no, it's because I took it from... So that's the first level, is rebuild, and then um, what I'm doing now is upgrading. There's an event before Old Hold that fires it. Did you get Old Hold? I don't remember. That was, like, last week, probably. You got that beautiful fucking cavern that I'm really annoyed about. I want that. Oh, these guys are annoying. Um, seventy one, I can attack the command again. I'm getting so much fucking prestige from this as well. Rebuilding the rails. And it's like, I, yeah. I, I don't need prestige right now. Prestige sources are really easy to come by, I found. Yep. 
Like, that's why all the events that are like, ooh, you get 0 0.25 yearly prestige. It's like, ooh-wee. <laughs> I'm sitting at 100 and gaining 3.8. I have minus 3% prestige decay, so... Like, I practically trend toward 100, just, just because. Uh, I'm losing 0.87, but rail upgraded, plus 2 prestige. Like, constantly. Oh my god, I'm so far ahead in tech! Beautiful. So you're digging. That's good. You need to get to probably 70. Yeah, I'll throw some points at you. New idea group. Hmm. New idea group in any category. I have put none thought into this, but I am a hard, I'm ahead of time on Diplo and Miltech. Feels like all core cost reduction will be good. Yeah. So administrative or expansion or. I on went hands, with uh, imperialism for that. It give me. Yeah. On the other hand, influence cost. and have a whole bunch of subjects. Sounds fun. Oh, imperialism. That kind of does everything, doesn't it? Yep. Oh, great. Yeah. Prestige decay minus one. I need that. <laughs> it's so necessary. I don't know what your problem is. Hmm. Don't be so rude to imperialism. Or prestige, even. Naval ideas. Oh, mm. yeah. Uh, discovery in Ernavir. We've discovered an incredible cavern in our capital. We get Mykos Karak. Monthly Splendor plus two. Mykos okay. Karak. What? Well, that's good, I guess. Sure. That it doesn't say anything. Why is there no description on what that is? It's just monthly Splendor plus two, and it's purplish pink it's good Del delightful hey pancake i'm busy what do you want why is this guy the blade marches or whatever trying so hard why is he like that what's his problem <laughs> don't be mean to him Wait, does everywhere have paved? Oh no, here's my best road. I especially love when you um, pave over your um, improved rails with roads, so then you go even faster. Yeah. Yeah, that is pretty cool. So with advanced dwarf our rail seventy five percent, and these roads, uh, plus fifteen percent, I like almost double speed. It's great. What am I saving up money for? I'm not. I just can't spend it fast enough. <laughs> Build some more centers for kids who can't read good. Yep, that's a good building. Pave under it so the tracks are smoother. True. I need to re download my auto clicker. Because that's just. No, I'm not bothering with that. Yeah, I would have just, just give me the give me the give me the clay, you jerk face. Not you. AI. <laughs> hey, the elven majority is expelled. Off you fuck, you knife eared twat. So this is a hundred and five aggressive expansion. It may possibly cause some people to 
feel a certain way toward me. A fucking gold mine depleted again. We've upgraded this province 212 times, and it's 87 development! <laughs> oh my god, you sack shite. Alright, I think I go for... I'm gonna go for influence, actually. I want the aggressive expansion impact. At least it's only 4 dev to get back up to 110. I should also check to see if I have AE impact policies. I do. If I finish influence, I get another minus 15. Is that relevant? Kind of. One of the first to the right actually has ideas and descriptions. One of them being sailors plus 10,000 and marines force limit. What? Like one of these ones? This guy? That one? Where do I see the sailors? I mean, it's got zero sailors, so apparently not. Is it when you own uh, when you own it, maybe, or when you are playing as of Dow? Whatever. Oh no, they're called Black Step. Also, there's another hold here. Verkal Osovar. It's the hold you took already that gives sailors in their ideas. Oh, in their ideas, okay. But I don't have Diplo points. <laughs> hey, I got a beautiful hold. It's not what I wanted, but it's, it's fine. It's good enough. It's Tua Duamacon. Why would these dwarves... Why would dwarves living here give you sailors and marines? Hmm. Yeah, none of this is implemented yet. Quick, hurry! There's rebels on the road. Oh my god, I move so fast. The ruler used to be crazy and decided they needed a, rem a marine regiment. That's kind of fun. The blue scales struck back? You're right. They're doing well now. They've got... A gigantic horde. It's gigantic. They have 40,000 ducats in their treasury. <laughs> I just want to point out that I'm at 111,000 ducats roughly, and I've been subsidizing the blue scale 800 ducats a month for a while. <laughs> they're doing stuff with it. And they have not yet put. I mean, their horde is gigantic. Yeah, they're fighting Laurent right now. Oh god, what if Laurent steals the horde? They're probably Maybe that's not. why maybe that's why there was no horde. You think it's been being stolen? Could be. Probably. They suck, right? Rebuild old Dwarvar Rail? Sure. Imagine rebuilding and not just like upgrading. Well, hey, look, not all of us can have Abentech 21. I'm still behind. Coming from the one who was ahead for most of the game, this is kind of funny to me. Why do I have no fleet but sailors? One of our one of the idea groups gives base sailors. I think it's um uh, Central Recruiting I've got it from. Oh yeah, it's part of centralism. Sailor increase plus twelve fifty. Yeah, it's it's beautiful. I mean I'm so totally gonna. If I could use these 3,000 sailors to create marines, I'd totally be for it, actually. Yeah, some of our dwarves just sit around in the taverns, joshing their neighbors, you know, joking around, saying, hey, I'm a sailor. They're What's sailing that? in their tankards. Yeah, I'm, I'm a sailor. What does that mean? I I don't know. It's my profession, though. <laughs> we, we don't have any boats, no boats, so just, you know, we just kind of chill, just hang out. Well, Ovdel Tunger is there. They've got, they can have boats, and you can conquer them. I feel like some of these uh, these these provinces should be renamed as soon as I take them. Uh, like uh, Goblin Grotto, 
probably wouldn't stay being called Goblin Grotto when I take it. Oh, Blue Scales about to get murdered. I mean, I say about to, like... They're close to having their... They're one province away from their horde. Hey, Ovdal Kanzad has just got a secondary specialization. They can have secondary? Apparently, because huh. I've got Metropolis and it's just told me that I can have a foundry. I didn't know they could do that. Nor did I. Pardon me while I lag the game. I'm going to upgrade every single one of my governor's residences or whatever. Yeah, I did that as well. But the game's just continuing to play. I can't believe how stable this is yeah. after that first session. Such a marked difference. I need to get my, my development like maxed out everywhere so that I can then do every single building in every single province, except for forts, obviously, because who would ever do such a thing? Naturally. Um, and then also I can build a mage tower in every province. I'm at war with somebody who has a coastline. Use those sailors. Wait, wait, whoa, 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 I missed it. Ah, shoot, the blue scale did something. Oh, I have it Stupid. open. I have it open still. Blue scale, her uh, are equal amongst men. Long has been our journey, but finally we've proven to all those who have doubted us that we are true and respectable members of the civilized and international community, whether they like it or not. Long are the days of blue scale people were slaughtered by bands of greedy adventurers. No, now we are the quest givers. Uh, they're no longer seen as a monstrous nation. Probably because they're seen as fucking dead, because Lawrence just murdered them. No, the horde. Did they it's actually get it? Oh, it's still. It's still it's, no, it's still gigantic. They didn't take it. All right. I didn't he's see gonna, them gonna, siege it. In fairness, he's gonna do the thing. He's gonna he's gonna raise. He's gonna awaken the dragon and kill all of the humans. We are the dragon. It it, it is us though, right? We are that. We the dwarves? No, there's an the actual. Like dragon, god. It's like M something. My my ghost. Mi mi Migos. My ghost. I don't know. I forget already. Yeah, I can give him my money. The problem is that paradox. You know, never assumed that someone would ever want to give more than a hundred gold at a time. <laughs> so even using an auto clicker and control shift click, like, takes some effort to actually gift large sums of money. Which is understandable. I wouldn't. I don't give anyone any money. Imagine having a text field where you could just type a number, right? What kind of technology do you think that would take? Some future shit there, right there. More they, digging. They only need 75,000 gold for the thing. But there's something really appealing about giving them 110,000 gold. I I don't find that appealing at all. 
Uh, no, just me. They have 150 grand. <laughs> We're passionately striking the beautiful <laughs> earth. Click all the buttons, you silly kobolds. Do I have all the rail now too? I don't have all the rail. Why don't I have all the rail? I want to click the button more. Yeah, it only lets you do it a little bit. But why though? Mm -hmm. Oh, you can only have so many active at once apparently. And then I get a pop-up for every single one. Interesting. No, I, I don't really have a soft spot for the kobolds. It's just that somebody suggested that we do it. And it is something to spend my money on. And it'd be funny for me, to me, if the blue scale kobolds like murder the rent. You know, I can like win a war via proxy by making them destroy all the stuff. I'm in favor. Yeah, the clicks are pretty significant. It does does some stuff. Why is he not clicking the button more often? I need Grizumbarod 2 to have a center for kids who can't read good. That can be done. It's funny, at first I was kind of really against having um, the roads just have numbers next to them, but they make sense and I can find them so much easier than if they had like names. Yeah, I know, all right? Like I, I actually have thought the exact same thing recently. It's like, the merchants want me to upgrade Dvarav, Dvaravad 15, and it's like, all right, I know this is the name of that road. It's probably about here. Bam. Yeah. And you're like, usually with win one or two, it's really nice. I think we should henceforth call all locations on the planet numbers. Uh, I'm not going to go that far. Why not? You got because something I'm against not numbers? Insane. Yes, mm. I do have something against numbers. <laughs> they confuse. My truce up with you is in 71. Oh, fuck, that's the same, same as when my truce with you is up. Yeah, I decided my dwarves need to see the sun a little bit. Uh, so we took Harpy's Gate and, and all this kind of outside -y stuff. Also, I'm really curious, is there anything here? What is that green area? I wonder if you have any vision that I don't have. Rebels? There are rebels? Where? Apparently you don't so what know, do I need? know of any of my, uh, any regions that I don't know of. What do I need with this, like, Marhold thing? Do I just have to own Marhold and then... I'll have a new decision show up or something. Seems likely. I wonder how they handle this, because, like, province connections I thought were hard-coded. Isn't... Is it like a canal or something that they add, or how do they connect these two provinces that aren't always connected? Oh, fuck yes. Cheap people's... I got two level fives costing 13 ducats each and one level five costing nine ducats. Absolutely delightful.
Would you like to go to war with the command in about six months? Uh, sure. I don't know why I just built soldiers' households. I don't need those. Whoops. Yeah, they can Whatever. seem a bit weak. I mean, they're not. Mm -hmm. Like, in, in a multiplayer, you have to build them, but... Eh. Mage Tower. Now, they're good. Yeah. But they take up the... the money... Right, they don't, they don't let you build many factories, and I like money. Yeah, so do I. Conflicts in a rising city. I like the artificers, they're neat. Yeah, they seem fun. Cobalt Horde is occupied by rebels. Green scale separatists in the Horde. It's gigantic still, but they're not contributing to it. What What is going on here? How do they have 100% autonomy in this province? Why are they so bad? I'm giving them so much money. Oh, I'm down they so have, much on power production as well. <laughs> they have 166 grand now. Why haven't they turned the thing in yet? It's unreasonable. When the artificers are dis uh, unhappy with you, it increases tech cost. I don't want to keep them happy. Does gifting increase inflation? It doesn't actually. No, their inflation is uh, zero percent right now. Why don't you do more colonies at once because you have the money? That's actually a really good idea. I don't know why I don't. No, my golden era. Also, what about that coal stuff? Where's that coal stuff? We That's need, not till uh, enlightenment. enlightenment. Hmm. We're not yet enlightened enough. Yeah, we're dumb dwarves. <sighs> Everything is so cheap to develop right now. I have so many provinces that, like, cost the bare minimum. Yeah, like four. 